Welcome to the Internet People Podcast. I am your host, Kenyon Long here. Do like your mama does and your cousin does too. Hit that subscribe button wherever you're listening to this podcast at or wherever you're watching it at. All right, let's just keep it 100, though. But look, if you're on that Apple Podcast, hit that rate and review. All right. And so you can share this podcast. I hit that share button as well, fam. If you're not Spotify, OK, hit that follow button and turn that notification bell on for me real quick. Just do me a favor, bro. Hey, 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 do me a favor. Go ahead and hit that button and uh, hit that share button too, man. Share it on your Instagram tag. Your boy at Kenyon Long. Let me know you check the pod out, fam. And, of course, this is brought to you by the all-new brand, all-in-one website, KenyonLong.com. Home to all of my shows and my content, man. You get the Kenyon Long Show. You get bonus episodes of the Kenyon Long Show. Uncut versions of the Kenyon Long Show. You get the Internet People Podcast audio format. And you get the Internet People Podcast video format you'll see honestly and truly as well as my original long media studios shows on there as well and you get the dope newsletter man and the newsletter ain't gonna spam you man but just drop your email or your phone number and it'll let you know about what things i got going on during the week or what you missed also man of course we'll have some giveaways on that thing to it, man, and the secret email for you to be a producer on one of my shows, man. Uh, submit your viral TikToks, your memes, your tweets, and uh, you can go ahead and email that email, and I'll put it right there in the newsletter. Let's get it, man. Um, happy to be back, man. Of course, I'm gonna do a little short format. You guys have been rocking with me. You haven't missed it. You missed out last week's episode. Check that out. I put up the audio version of the Kenyon Long Show, man. So I'm just doing some new things on this. You, you're getting the best of the internet. Maybe I'm going to name this, you know, you're getting the best of me from the internet uh, as well. And of course, you already know I interview some of the dopest people on the internet people podcast as well as talk about what's viral during the week or in my life. All right. Uh, from the internet. I don't know. But look, man, look, I just celebrated my daughter's 14th birthday, man. And uh, we had a blast over the weekend. Uh, Went shopping and everything. That was cool. Went to the mall, you know, let let her throw it in the bag. But uh, I'm going to tell you something. On Sunday, we went to go see Candyman. Woo, good movie, man. Shouts out to uh, all the actors in Candyman and the directing. Oh, it was it was phenomenal, man. I enjoyed it, man. I'm just here to say I'm available for Candyman 2. I am available. And uh, so y'all holler at me. I would love to be in Candyman 2. Definitely done a horror movie before. It hasn't seen the light of day yet. But you can check IMDb. See Kenyon Long. And my name is up there. Look, man. Um, so that was dope, man. This is what I knew, though. This is a little hack for y'all, too. I knew this because, look, we're going to see Candyman on a Sunday. We live in a small town, right, outside of L.A., and I'm like, okay, nobody gonna be there. We gonna be in the movie theater by ourselves. I knew it. I knew it. Get up in it because it's Sunday, and most men are watching the NFL. Now I was okay with this going to the movie theater on a Sunday because my 49ers didn't play Green Bay till later that night. I'm not talking about it. I don't want to talk about the 49ers versus Green Bay game. Not gonna talk about it, man. But I already knew. I'm like, look, I got plenty of time to go to the movies. We can eat afterwards. But we went to the movie where you can eat at. All right. Black people all about multitasking. All right. So my daughter loved going to the movie theater, enjoyed it, got up in there. Ain't nobody up in there. Ain't nobody in there but us. I told my wife, you want to just move around? You know, we can just, you know, we can move around whatever we want. She's now nah, I'm good. I'm good right here. I'm like, okay. I mean, we got the whole theater to ourselves. So it felt like I rented it out, but I didn't. All right. So uh, that was dope, man. But let me tell you something about kids, birthday parties and just birthday parties in general. I was going to the grocery store here locally in California here. And what's the price of ice cream, man? What, what's going on with ice cream, man? So I went to get some ice cream because you know you got to have cake. When you got to have cake, you got to have ice cream. My wife got the cake. So I like, look, you know, we kind of low on ice cream. I got to have cake and ice cream. I got to do it. I don't care how old you are. You got to have cake and ice cream. You just got to. When is a birthday party? All right. Fellas, we already know I'm on that ghetto keto. All right. So I ain't I ain't going crazy with it. But when it's a birthday, I got to have cake and ice cream. I go into the grocery store. I'm looking. There is nine dollar ice cream, nine dollar ice cream. 
what kind of ice cream is that? What kind of cow is making nine dollar ice cream? I said, what is this? They got oatmeal ice cream. They got almond milk ice cream. They got keto ice cream. They got coconut milk ice cream. They got protein ice cream. Like what happened to just regular ice cream, man? I just want regular. It's too many options. That's the problem with y'all. It's it's too many options nowadays. I'm like, look, man, I'm just looking for regular ice cream. You remember back in the day, right? You knew how rich somebody was or how poor somebody was when you went to your friend's birthday party. All right. I, I just didn't know this. Like my parents, you know, we are multitaskers, man. My dad go in. He like, look, I got you some Van chocolate straw. I was like, what? What is this to go with your cake? What, Van chocolate straw. That's a that's a flavor. You know what I mean? Bring it out. He's got vanilla, chocolate and strawberry. You mean Neapolitan ice cream? Neapolitan. It didn't even taste. And the flavors didn't even taste like they're supposed to taste. It wasn't as chocolate as it needed to be. And we would just eat the vanilla and the chocolate and then leave the strawberry. Like this was the worst. So I, I just just give me the chocolate. Dad, can you just give me the chocolate ice cream or give me the vanilla? Pick one. Pick one. All right. I don't need the three in the one, man. All right. We got enough people over here. So he would just get Neapolitan on my mom. Neapolitan ice cream, man. But you ever go to a friend's house, like a white friend, and you go to their house, you see something different. Like, oh, y'all got multiple ice creams. You go to a rich white friend's house back in the day. They got chocolate ice cream. They got vanilla ice cream. They got Rocky Road. I remember when Rocky Road came out. At least I thought so. Anyway, I remember. I'm like, oh, this is Rocky Road. They got flavors you ain't never heard of. And the mom be like, oh, yeah, just pick whatever ice cream you want. Like what? I got options. I got options. So I'm like, yo, this is crazy. But you got options, too, man. Definitely, man. This podcast is dope, man. And of course, I use Buzzsprout, man. You got a podcast just like your boy, man. You want to get it out everywhere on Amazon Music, on Apple, on all other podcasts, man. Use Buzzsprout, man. They are hooking you up. They are my podcast editors, man, and the distributors, I should say. And they can also edit too, man. They got a brand new thing. They can edit and master your podcast for you. It's called Magic mastering man so buzzsprout man gets my podcast everywhere and i want you to be down with buzzsprout man they are hooking you up as well with a 20 dollars amazon gift card man so they make it super simple and easy man hit the link in below and sign up your podcast with buzzsprout man doesn't matter what kind of podcast you got all right i got multiple podcasts and both of them on on buzzsprout man distributed by buzzsprout man they got a dope podcast that helps you about bringing up and doing your podcast and marketing your podcast so shout out to buzzsprout man hit that link in the description below also man just announced okay canva man canva raised some more money that valuation is up man i told you guys canva i don't know how much it is a billion i think crazy money man so you want to be canva man i use canva every day no doubt no cap bro i use canva every day i use canva using my tiktok backgrounds i use canva for my youtube uh thumbnails when it's for the kenya long show where it's for the internet people podcast i use canva every day mobile while i'm out here in the field wherever i use canva i'm not lying i use canva every day so i had to step it up and be a pro camera pro man but you can just use it just for those things you can use it for multiple things you can use it for presentations all right you're going back to work and you do some dope presentations do that with canva pro man um use canva pro man be a pro member and hit that link in the description below when it comes to ice cream man you go to your cousin's house right or at least you go to a friend in the hood all right when you go to a friend in the hood house and you see they got that that five dollar ice cream that big tub but that tub is about 10 gallons and it's just like oh no this is it tastes like crap you're like oh man all right maybe maybe they they put the bill they mama put the bill on the presents because you skipping on the ice cream that's the worst ice cream that big tub of ice cream when somebody come and bring 
that big tub of ice cream, you want to slap them. Aunties, aunts, don't matter. Grandma, when you walk into a party with that big tub of ice cream, it's like I'm just eating cake. Like I'm I'm not eating cement ice cream. I'm not doing. Like we used to have like pizza parties and stuff in elementary school. And the teacher, you know the budget is slim. We know the budget. Teachers, you know, we appreciate you. Thank you for your service. We know your budget is slim. All right. Y'all work hard in class. Then you have the party, but they bring in that big tub of ice cream. You want to smack, smack the crap out of them. Like, what the hell are you thinking? Get this big tub of ice cream out of here. I don't want to eat cement for ice cream. That's all I'm saying, man. So uh, I don't know what's going on with the price of ice cream. I definitely have been thinking about coming up with my own ice cream. And as an adult, you just be like, you know what? Maybe we can just. Maybe we can just make our own ice cream. You know what I'm saying? Like, let's make our own ice cream. Like, I, I'm going to just save some money here. Now, I did buy the two for five, okay? The two for five, regular. I got some chocolate. I got some death by chocolate. I got some Rocky Road. Because my wife and my daughter love chocolate. Now, for me, fam, once again, you already know, I'm on that ghetto keto. Lost 20 pounds on them. <laughs> I am camera ready. I am camera ready you feel me i'm getting ready like you know when you make your wife jealous you already know you're camera ready so uh you know face looking slim and trim all them covid pounds is gone fam you want to know about ghetto keto listen to the episode ghetto keto as well man um so what i did do though is you know i ain't i don't just cheat all the way i ghetto keto allows you to flex all right girl flex huh it allows you to flex, all right? So I had the cake, but I did get some keto ice cream. And I do love keto ice cream, too. So I did get some keto, maybe protein ice cream. I think it's protein ice cream. So I did get some protein ice cream, and uh, which I love. I'm not going to say the brand because uh, they are not sponsoring this podcast. So I uh, got some keto ice cream, put that on, or get a protein ice cream, put that on top of the cake. You know, a little small piece of cake, half of a hand, and I'm good. I'm participating. My wife be like, why you ain't participating? I'm participating, all right? I ain't about to go crazy. I ain't about to be Nick Cannon and wild out. No pun intended. Nick, holla at your boy. Uh, but look, that's it. I'm, I'm participating, and we ended. We had a good time, man. So uh, going on on the internet this week, man, R. Kelly has been found guilty. Jigga Kelly not guilty. That's ironic. That's ironic. Because guess what? Jigga ain't guilty in this case. But uh, R. Kelly, you are guilty. So R. Kelly is going to jail for a long time, man. Um, Sad to say, man. Sad to say, man. But here's the, here's the real question. Are y'all still are DJs going? Y'all still going to play R. Kelly? Are you still going to request R. Kelly at the wedding for some of y'all getting married? Are you still going to play R. Kelly, R. Kelly at your wedding? DJs, are you still going to play it? I know you are. I, some of y'all haven't stopped. He's guilty. Stop playing. I haven't listened to R. Kelly myself. Have you? I haven't. I haven't listened to R. Kelly. I really, I know you can separate the music from the man, because guess what? Y'all don't know these people. Y'all don't know these famous people already said it on the Kenya Long show. Y'all don't know what these people in, into? Trick Daddy like to get his booty licked. All right, eat the booty gang. You don't know what these people are into. So you don't know. So you can separate the music from the person, because we don't know what people do behind closed doors. I don't know. Okay, but what R. Kelly did ain't cool. And he about to be sitting down for a long time to think about it. So, uh, yeah, I was about to say rest in peace to R. Kelly, but it's a wrap, R. Kelly. Uh, definitely it's a wrap, man. So, uh, you guys let me know. Comment on below. Uh, Internet People Podcast YouTube channel. Comment on this. If you're watching this, man, on Kenyan Comedy Facebook, comment below. Let me know. Should R. Kelly be going to jail? Should he be going to jail? All right. And also, let me know. Are you still going to be playing R. Kelly on your Spotify? On your Apple? Are you still going to be playing R. Kelly? I haven't. 
check my streams. I have not played R. Kelly. I have no desire. I'm too, listening to too much Griselda. Boom, 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 boom. All right. Um, super excited, man, about that. New episodes of the Kenya Long Show dropping this week, man. I appreciate everyone uh, showing me love. I'm not really trying to put it out too much there. Uh, but I'm working hard on that, man. The Kenyan Long Show on YouTube. That's its very own YouTube channel. So uh, if you like, let me just kind of break it down. If you like, uh, it's like a meme news show. Uh, if you like The Soup or if you like Deezus and Mero. All right, basically, that's it. If you like Deezus and Mero, or they report the news, just make jokes off of it. That's it. All right. Um, pretty much right now, everybody likes rap and sports. So I'm pretty much talking about that. And of course, some viral news. So pretty much I combined like three shows into one. Uh, my show in my DMs that I had separately, uh, I, I made that as a segment for the Kenya Long Show. So I just do a reaction uh, based off a viral video from TikTok or a viral meme. Uh, so make you submit that to uh, by joining the KenyaLong.com newsletter. Read that newsletter. You get that email text to you. That dope newsletter text to you by dropping your phone number. I'm not going to spam you. I'm not going to hack you. Or drop your email address. You don't want to drop your phone number. So uh, the Kenya Long Show on YouTube, man. New episodes. Trying to drop two episodes this week, man. We got a goal. Uh, so hit that subscribe button, man. I don't really care about the subscribers at all on YouTube. But I do care about the people that's watching it. So uh, just trying to get them views up. So we get them views up on the Kenya Long Show. I appreciate that, fam. And of course, uh, Kenyon Comedy on Facebook, man. You checking me out on Facebook? Facebook Watch Kenyon Comedy is the page to check it out, man. You can also watch Facebook Watch on your Oculus Quest Two. So you got an Oculus Quest Two? Go to the Facebook Watch app while you're chilling in VR. You can watch that, man, as well. Um, new Hangouts coming up on Oculus, man. Um, I'll have that situation going on. Of course, I don't have a virtual event coming on yet, but uh, I'll have a virtual event coming soon, too, as well in VR. Man, of course, you can tell your Amazon device to play Internet People podcast. Uh, also, you can tell your Amazon device to play Honestly and Truly podcast. Ah, this show is crazy with my coach, as for Thomas. Download that podcast. Download it. Download it. Wherever podcast you have, man, download it. You can watch those episodes on Kenyan Comedy Facebook as well. So that is on Facebook right now. We are working out some logistics as far as video goes. Still trying to get that right, man. Um, I do stream it on Twitch as well. Uh, Kenyan Long on Twitch, man. But yeah, you want to be a producer of one of these shows, man, read that dope newsletter. If you want to uh, edit the video, you want to be a podcast editor, always looking for some uh, podcast clip editor. You want to edit, you edit podcast clips, hit your boy up, send me a DM on Instagram. And uh, yo, man, that's it, man. This is a short podcast. Let me know if you like this format, man. Keeping it nice and short, nice and tight. All right, you know what I mean? Because I ain't famous. You know what I mean? I ain't, I ain't, I ain't famous. But, yo, listen, subscribe, rate, review, check out the podcast, man. So support both of my podcasts, both of my shows, Kenyon Long Show, man. And support KenyonLong.com by dropping your email and subscribing. It's free, man. It's free. It's free, man. And you get to see those bonus episodes.